Hey guys, it's Scoobyz123 here, and I'm back with an all new real life video. And, well, I don't know how to start this, but if you guys do remember that I did make a video about when I al almost got robbed, and it was by, like, quote unquote friends, but this one was completely different. We weren't with those people, the my friends, and we weren't with like anybody else okay to start this off I went on vacation and it was because that my uncle and aunt came over to visit me particularly they li they live not really in the United States but they it's like it's like a territory it's not really it's like n it's not really um America nor is it any other place. It's kind of its own country-ish place. But it's weird. And they came all the way from that place to my ha to my home. I'm sorry. I don't want to say where I live. I'm sorry. It's kind of eh. And we went to... Oh, screw. We freaking went to Las Vegas. And we went to Las Vegas knowing that... Oh, frick. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> but I'm literally just rambling off up to this point but we went to las vegas on vacation knowing that you know we were gonna you know enjoy our time at a hotel well apparently after a few days after that hotel we go and you know we go and explore on a new a new place and this place was like a marketplace where it sold a bunch of things and it was outside too and so you know we parked we locked our doors and everything and basically, I think we were like leaving. Yeah, I think we were leaving because we had all our stuff. Um, and I remember that we, I had my backpack and my backpack had my iPad, my freaking Nintendo 3DS, but I did not have my iPod in there. I left it charging. And the thing is like, the when we came okay we left the car and we went shopping as soon as we come back we find out that the door was jammed and open and i find out that our luggage our freaking briefcase this is my dad's briefcase my briefcase my uncle's and aunt's briefcase was gone and it was weird. I was so scared because I like I thought that people were gonna come back and like steal our stuff even more, but apparently my iPod was stolen again. L well, not really again, but uh, I'll tell you a later time when uh, how I lost my iPod. But apparently they took my iPod and I couldn't do anything about it. So you know. We didn't know what else to do, but we went to a Walmart that was close by, and we shopped for freaking, like, for food, for clothes, and I was just sitting there the whole time, like, why? Out of all the people in the freaking country, you would steal from us. I'm not gonna lie, we did have an SUV that looked legit, like, it looked great, but, like, I'm serious, like... Oh man, whatever you do, just lock your doors. And we did lock our doors. The thing is, the alarm didn't go off because we did lock our doors twice. And so we find the door jammed, find our luggage gone, and it was just a complete disaster. I cannot believe that our stuff was stolen. And trust me, th there will be a part two to this. And remember, please do remember about my iPod. Because, oh my... Do I have a story entirely about that? And it's not not the first time I lost it. It was actually the people when they stole my thing. And I'm just going to leave it off there because I don't want to start going into that story too. So, yeah. Basically, we literally got robbed without knowing. And the thing that thing sucks is that the guy literally... The stupidest thing about all of this, we found the door not even cracked open the back door wasn't even cracked open none of it was cracked open and the people who robbed us was so stupid they didn't take my stuff they didn't take the ipad or anything 
That was like, oh my god, I'm such a genius. And nor did they take my dad's briefcase. It's kind of like a portfolio kind of ish thing. But at the same time, they didn't take that either. And he still had his iPad. I mean, and his he still had his phone. I mean, he takes his phone everywhere. And it was so crazy because, like, they didn't take any of my stuff or my dad's briefcase. But they took our luggage. And it was, like, the stupidest thing in the, in the freaking right mind. You don't, like... For me, I'm kind of surprised, but at the same time, I'm not because it was in a kid's bag. You would probably think that there was, like, stupid stuff like, uh, you know, homework and crap like that, which is useless to you if you're a robber. And, yeah, I freaking got robbed. I, I just... And it wasn't, like... It wasn't, like, now that, like, I got robbed. It was a long time I got robbed. Like, probably all the way back in 2014, I believe. Either that or 2015, I don't freaking remember. No, maybe a little bit more. 2013, probably. I mean, that was when everything, like, hit. No, wait, never mind. It was actually 2015, never mind. Oh, wait, no, 2016. Yeah, 2015. Perfect. I'm getting confused. But, yeah. Basically, I got robbed. And it was the most stupidest thing ever. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry that this video is, like, you know, kind of shorter than the others. But I'm trying my best to get back to, you know, making videos. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please do hit that subscribe button if you did enjoy the story. And yeah, I'm going to be making vid more videos shortly. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please do hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. <gasps> Bye!